you know you gotta, you know you gotta skip ahead because you don't want to get no copyright notices. I got kills in Atlanta. There is no demon in the phantom. Shooting that bitch in the back. You damn right. That's what I get. Getting two pieces in Atlanta. Yes, so God damn, I got killed. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ, coming to you live. I'm going to get more ass waxery. Live and direct from the place that we like to respect for the first two as the ass factory. Y'all already know what time it is. It's time for me to come out here and get some hot shots. Get it, get it. Who's that picking in my window? Pow. No boxy, nobody now. Look, man, I just figured... Somebody said something about bringing the panda hat back, so I figured I ain't had no panda hat, but I got a tiger hat. It don't matter, man. It doesn't matter what it is. I figured I'd bring it back, man. And uh, look, why not bring it back in a way that I, uh, in, in only a way, in a way that only I can, man. You know, um, I, like I said, man, look, look, the inspiration for the day is, is truthfully straight up. Get your ass off the purse. Hot shark, get it, get it. What was that, tiger shark, crouching tiger, hidden shark? I don't know what it is, man, but uh, the, the, it's, it's relentless. I am relentless. I've been doing this thing on YouTube forever, man. And I've seen a lot of people come and go. I've seen a lot of people just die out. I've seen a lot of people not want to change their styles and not want to just do that. But look, man, there's one thing that remains. I am the innovator of YouTube. A lot of the stuff that you see, man, it was your boy first. It just said, it's just like back in the day, it was Chris Moore was Alpha Prime and I was Alpha. Like, it was we were the first ones. Oh, well, some of the first ones, I'm, I'm going to say it like that. But hey, you know, well, we're definitely the first black ones. I said that away, man. I don't know if he's Dominican or not. But that ain't the point. The point is, you got to be relentless in this thing, man. Sometimes, like, people were just waiting, sitting there waiting for me to quit and do all this stuff. There's some people that me having my son was the best news that they ever could have gotten. Yes! He's gone! And we get a chance. But you know what? Fuck that! I'm back. Just like that. Just like that to knock some asses out. What are you going to do? Drop that bitch from the long range. Two beats, huh? They was waiting for me to leave so they could say two piece, uh. They was waiting for them so they could say, Now look at this shit! I looked at the fucking kill cam and that bitch didn't hit not even one shot. But they was waiting. They was waiting, quietly waiting for, for, for me to get up out of here so they could do their thing and, and, and feel like, you know, nobody would know who your boy was and all this stuff. And that's how people are out there in the world. They are waiting for you to quit so they can take your ideas and run with them so they can be that next one in line. They just waiting. They just hoping that you quit. I hope Jay get fed. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what people were thinking. Hope Jay get fed up. I hope that he feel like, because like, I, I'll be honest with you, back then, I'm going to be I'm gonna be straight up with you. There was no money in YouTube back then. So as a result, there was literally no point in me doing it because I had to feed my family. Like if you are a, if you young or you, you don't have any real responsibilities, you can do YouTube just for the love of it and be happy, but it takes up a lot of your time. So imagine trying to justify spending that amount of time not making money when all I ever done in my life is hustle anyway. You know what I'm saying? Now imagine spending, spending that, uh, explaining to my wife, yeah, this might work out three years down the line with no proof. There was no, there was no test, test, test cases or no case studies or none of that shit. It wasn't none of that back then, man. We only had Chris Moore that had made it that was black. And then I guess Mark and Jay was coming up back then. Look at these two dumbass hip fire. You get caught up in it. But I had to be a survivor. That's what I am, man. I'm a survivor. Like I said, I've seen a lot of people come and go. And I know my views are down, but you can't take a three-year break and not expect this shit, man. Look, it's just like I'm starting all the way back over from zero. Look at this dumbass dude right there. Look, never follow nobody. That's what I said. I'm setting that sentry gun up for your bitch ass. That's what I'm going to do. Woo, look at that hardest sentry kill. I know he was going to come back for the revenge kill. I know because that was me. But like I said, though, man, look. If you're doing your thing and you coming up and you feel like you're doing a little something, look at that shit! They, I can't shoot through the desk, but he can. Get the fuck out of here, game. You doing your thing, you coming up, man. It don't matter what part of life, but I got something for their ass. Hell, how them bound? Get them, boy. Get that motherfucker, boy. Oh, 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 oh. What the fuck you thought you was gonna do, two piece? Huh? What the hell is my teammate doing standing right behind them dudes and they just ran by him? It don't matter, man. But if you're doing your thing, man, and you feel like you got some ideas that are ahead of their time, they probably are. A lot of my ideas were just purely ahead of their time. I was just like the Sega Dreamcast, man. Like I said, you got some people that's going to come up every year and they're going to have a meteoric rise to the top and they're just going to make it. But 
the vast majority, just like some people get their parents' insurance money and they instantly rich, they never have to work hard. Or you got some people that uh that uh they, they, they come out with an idea and their first business is superly successful. That happens. But the vast majority of us, what the fuck was that? This shit just rolled back like a motherfucker. Anyway, but the vast majority of us have to work and grind and hope and just keep plugging and chucking until we break through. Let's take out, I mean, if you want to look at it like that, man, look at look at how Mark and Jay, Mark and Jay had to grind, grind, grind. BBG had to grind. He on Twitch, though. He had to grind, grind, grind. Cash Nasty and, and Chase Money had to grind, grind, grind for years before they actually broke through. And then you got to, like, then you might have somebody like this year, like No Limit Sean and Fredo. They just broke right on through the first nine months. And that's going to happen a lot right there. I mean, I mean it, it happens, but... We got to look at, look, I'm 25 and 3. They are the exception. They're not the rule, my dog. So don't, if you ain't coming up or if, even in your job, if you're not where you want to be, just remember, you got to grind, persevere, and be relentless. You got to be that relentless finisher. You got to have a relentless finisher badge and just do your thing, man, because you're going to make it, but you can. the only way that you can be absolutely certain that you don't make it is if you quit. That's it. Quitting is the only way to guarantee failure. There is no other way to do it. If you quit, you have guaranteed your own failure. You have taken your dream and you have taken a, you have taken it down to the coroner's officer office and you have signed your dream's birth certificate. I mean, death certificate right there. Right now, it's got a it's got a, a lifespan that is you and it has a it, ha, it 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 don't even have a birth certificate yet. But if you give up. You have just effectively signed your your dreams death certificate. So don't give up. Look, I'm back. I'm grinding. I'm putting up videos. Nobody really watching them, but my original people are there. And you see this, you see the success is coming back. Keep doing what you do. Look at what other people are doing to be successful. Don't bite it, but take a little bit here, a little bit there, and keep on going. But if you don't do what you're gonna do as soon as you want to, don't worry about it. Because those people are anomalies. You have people that make meteoric rises to the top, but the vast majority of us just going to have to grind it out and work. But I'm going to tell you one thing. When that success comes, it's going to come fast. Look at Cash. Cash grinded for Cash and uh, Chase grind three, four years. When they hit 100,000, Cash hit 100,000 like last year. Boom, he hit like 800,000 now. Look how fast that success comes. So it's going to make the grind well worth it. So you just got to grind, man. Just keep grinding. That's all you got to do, man. Like I said, I mean, ain't no disrespect to nobody that came up because they grinded in their own way. But what I'm saying is their grind is not your grind. So don't compare yourself to them, man. It just happens. I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Hello! 360 out this motherfucker, man. You think these guns came in one day? This was three years of going to the fucking gym right here, man. You think this motherfucking chest and abs came in one day? This was the three years. Three years. But anyway, watch me. If you don't believe me, watch what I'm about to do. Follow your boy. And, uh, you know. I'm out. Peace.